Welcome back to Knights TV. It's Tommy the V of Viola joined here with Jared Mitchell, who came through in a, in a porting in for the uh, Charlotte Knights. Uh, a triple, a two-run triple at that, and uh, Jared, a uh, first off, uh, exciting game for the team here. Another another big win uh, for you guys now, and uh, Norfolk was losing last I looked, so a chance to go 10 games up in the standings. Um, let's talk about you for a minute here, Jared. Uh, uh, your first triple, first triple-A triple. A triple. Uh, take me back to that. Were you thinking triple on that one? Uh, I mean, off the bat, yeah, but uh, before I was just kind of looking for something over the play, something I can handle, make sure I stay in the zone and uh, just really battle and put the ball in play and give, uh, give myself and our team a chance right there. And uh, luckily he threw me something kind of out over the plate and I got the barrel on it. So, 12 triples in the Southern League uh, at the time of your promotion, still lead the league uh, and obviously been here now for a while. Um, is that part of your game? I mean, the triple is an important part of your game? Uh, I think running is an important part of my game. Uh, you know, I mean, I happened to play in a park where the field was really big. There's a lot of grass, a lot of space out there, and uh, that was my home park every day. So I, I ended up hitting the ball, a lot of balls and gaps and stuff. I was able to run. But uh, definitely, like I said, you know, running is a part of my game. So I, I'll try to stretch singles in the doubles, doubles in the triples, and, you know, just kind of keep going like that and try to put pressure on the defense. It's been an exciting year uh, for you and, of course, for this team now. Uh, as I said, the team continues to play good baseball. Just talk to me about this team. I mean, they continue to get some wins here. Uh, I mean, there's, there's been a whole lot of – since I've been here, there's been a whole lot of clutch hitting. I mean, there's been good pitching. There's guys that's bridging it and guys that's closing it in the pen. And, uh, like I said, there's been clutch hitting, timely hitting right here. And, uh, I mean, that's how you get it done. You know, you, people stay high and you play well like that. And uh, you seem to roll off wins like that. Let me talk to you for a minute here about uh, – your time at LSU and, of course, uh, playing football, playing baseball, win a national championship. Uh, you win a college World Series. I mean, it was a, probably a great time in your life, right? Right, right definitely. Uh, I mean, the three years I spent at LSU, uh, I mean, I wouldn't give it away for anything. I had a great time there, met some really good people, and, uh, you know, was able to grow up a little bit mentally and physically there while I was there. So, like I said, it was a great time there for me to, to be able to grow and mature there. Your buddy was here the other day, Brandon LaFell, of course, with the Panthers. Uh, you guys uh, played together in LSU. What did you guys talk about when he was here? Uh, just kind of old times, man. And you know, I don't get to see him that much anymore. He uh, actually, back home, he lived in my house while I was gone just because he was there working out a little bit. But me and him were college roommates. And uh, so, I mean, being able to, you know, kind of just go back on the like, old times and, you know, be able to talk, it's always good to see each other. Well, great. Great to hear, Jared. Uh, last thing, uh, another win for the team. Where, what could we look forward to going uh, going forward here? Oh, same thing, man. I mean, like I said, you know, the, the key to winning is, you know, you have got guys throwing well for you, you're throwing a lot of strikes and timely hitting on the offensive side. If we can keep doing that, I think we'll be in good shape. Jared, I appreciate your time. Good luck to you. All right, thank you, man. All right, there he is, Jared Mitchell, who came through uh, with that triple, his first triple-A triple, a two-run triple at that, and the Charlotte Knights pick up another victory, and with the possibility of Norfolk losing, they can go up 10 games in exciting August here at Knight Stadium as we head into September. I'm Tommy DeVee, Viola. We'll see you next time right here on Knights TV.